It's not gonna stand by and let a whore sleep with another. I can't even bed. talk. Nobody Who's slept in your bed. Wife? You're the only You're one right, that slept in our talk. bed. Ronnie abuses me emotionally, verbally, financially on a daily basis. I constantly face punishment for calling him out on his lies and past infidelity. I'm made out to be a monster when I don't fall in line and answer Kim's questions. I am deemed a tyrant. Ronnie, this is disgusting. This is where she let somebody go in my bed. He is so extremely ugly. He's called me a whore, lazy, fat. I basically have a very short fuse when it comes to any type of accusation or question, and I certainly lose my temper. I feel like a pawn on a chessboard. I'm being played. I do not trust Ronnie at all. When I confront Ronnie, he gets very upset. He will ask me another question to completely change the topic. He will go so far as to actually tell me, you don't know what you're talking about. You're crazy. I didn't say it. You didn't hear it. Everybody knows you're crazy. Ronnie is constantly flipping the script. You've cheated on me, and I'm literally defending myself. Ronnie has gone so far as to accuse me of sleeping with a paraplegic and a dead man. Ronnie has a complete lack of empathy. Ronnie makes me out to be the bad guy, but at the same time, he will pretend or conveniently forget everything he's done. I can't tell you that Kim abuses Adderall, but I do believe that it intensifies her belief that I am doing something wrong on a daily basis. She doesn't sleep, and her jealousy and accusations are on steroids. Kim has stolen Adderall bottles from me. Kim is constantly taking Adderall and drinking Ripples, and it's a horrible combination. At my wedding, multiple guests came up to me and told me that Kim was tweaking. When she takes Adderall, she's a completely different person. That is absolutely no way to live. I feel like I have lost the ability to be myself because I don't want to do anything that is going to upset Kim or trigger her. Because of everything that's happened, I am definitely not the happy person that I used to be. I feel very lonely, very empty. I've basically turned into a hermit. I get up and go to work, and I go home. That is absolutely no way to live. I, I have no idea why I'm still married. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.